First, make sure you have a GitHub account. If you don't have one, please register. Next, create a folder for your GitHub repository. Install and open GitHub Desktop and log into your GitHub account. Create a new repository on your hard drive, then select the folder you created for your repository. Then give your repository a name and a description. Now open your map.config file. We need to make some edits before we can continue. First we need to specify how many players can be on this map. The options are small, medium, large, and any. In my case, I choose small. Next, we need to specify what modes we can play on. Consider bomb tag. If we enter it like this, MapMod thinks that we want bomb tag and tag, so keep in mind possible name overlaps. Bomb tag should only be called bomb. My map is only designed for race, so that's what I enter. I want to add a custom sky color, so I do this now. Then I save my config file. Next I create my map's thumbnail. This is optional. Just keep in mind the file must be called map. Compress all your map files into a zip folder. In my experience, WinRAR causes some issues, so I recommend using the zip utility included with Windows. Give the zip folder a name that you can remember. In your zip folder, your map files should be immediately accessible. If your map files are in a folder within your zip, it will not work. Copy your zip folder and head over to your repository folder. Inside of it, create a new folder called Maps and paste your zip into the new Maps folder. Going back out of your Maps folder into your main repo folder, create a new document called Index File. Make sure this file has no extension. Now open the index file with the text editor of your choosing. In the index file, you need to specify your map version number. Then press the pipe key on your keyboard. Next, specify the name of your zip folder. That's all for the index file. Go ahead and save it. Going back to GitHub Desktop, you should see it detected or changes. Give your changes a brief description, then press Commit. Our changes haven't uploaded yet, so press the Publish Repository button. If Keep This Code Private is checked, please disable it now. Now on your GitHub page, you should see the repository you just published. Now we need the URL for MapMod to use. Click your main branch, then replace the word tree with raw in the URL. Now copy this URL. Head on over to the host index file in your game folder, then open it up. Inside of it, replace use local with a URL you just copied. Make sure the URL ends with a slash. At the time of making this video, MapMod has a bug that will break if it's missing this slash. Go ahead and save your host index file. Launch your game, but this time host as a regular lobby. I only choose the race game mode as well as my map to force the game into playing my custom map only. Get your friends to install MapMod and join you. If everything works correctly, everyone should load in and be able to play. If any players join without map mod, they'll be sent instructions in-game to install it.
Should you want to add another map, you'll need to add it to the repository's map folder and update your index file. If you make updates to a map, you'll need to update the version number so everyone's game will know to update it as well. If you need any more help, you should check out the map mod repository wiki. It has instructions for most features, although some are only documented in the release notes. You're also welcome to join the developers discord or my own. All of the links you need will be in the description.